Cameron Chai here from Azon.com. I'm speaking to Tim Drake from Aspects, and he's going to show us there through their P7 Explorer SEM. Thanks, Cameron. So what we have here is the PSEM Explorer. It's an SEM EDS integrated solution for um, automated particle analysis as well as SEM EDS uh, analysis of uh, materials. So we have a gun cap going down through the column. We have a uh, stage, integrated stage chamber that's about five inches uh, uh, deep by six inches wide by seven inches uh, in depth so that you can load large samples into the chamber. It's got an 80 by 100 millimeters worth of travel in that in the XY direction, as well as we have the silicon drift detector for high performance characterization work uh, to increase throughputs uh, for these particle characterization. We as a SEM vendor are fairly unique in the sense that we have um, one integrated package um, as the, from the EDS to the SEM, which uh, allows us to do some very unique things for particle analysis. What we have here is the uh, software right now running particle analysis. You can see here in the upper left hand, upper left hand corner of the, uh, of the monitor we have particle scanning of this image. You can see here in the green, the detailed, where we're actually grabbing a thumbnail picture of that particle as it's being analyzed, as well as we're capturing an EDS or elemental composition spectrum for the uh, uh, identification of that material. On the bottom screen here, this is where the control panels are for the SEM uh, software. Um, everything's controlled using a mouse, as well as uh, while the analysis is being performed, we're automatically identifying all the features that are being seen here. So you can easily see that we've got about 300 particles, as well as the amount of time left uh, for the analysis. If we go back over here to the uh, stage tab, you can also see we've set up a certain area for scanning. So all we have to do is simply set up an area for scanning and it'll automatically go in and characterize these particles. You can also do manual imaging, just like you would for any other uh, electron microscope, as well as acquire uh, EDS uh, analysis for elemental purposes as well. Okay, Tim, who typically uses these types of instruments? We, we find these instruments in uh, industrial uh, applications, ranging from automotive to uh, engine manufacturers as well as uh, the health science industry for pharmaceutical companies where they're looking at drug molecules uh, for morph morphological uh, purposes as well as identifying contaminants and uh, also in the uh, forensic community where we look at uh, gunshot residue analysis where you can identify whether or not somebody's been in the proximity of a firearm being fired. And do you find that you sell quite a lot of these instruments based on the, on the, the physical size of your instrument, which is quite small, really? Yes, we actually have a fairly small footprint. It's only about two and a half uh, feet or uh, 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 maybe a half meter wide by about a meter deep. And it's also got an industrialized package to it. So in the end, that makes us uh, very uh, reliable in non-laboratory type environments. So we find ourselves a lot, a lot of the time in quality control environments where we're more at production as opposed to in a research laboratory. And so based on that size as well as the industrialized by design packaging that we have, it allows us to, uh, to install these in non-traditional lab environments. And does, do they find more applications in industrial applications because of the price as well? It's probably designed that cheaper than a... Uh, certainly, uh, certainly. A more dedicated lab device? Certainly. The, uh, the price point is also, uh, uh, it allows us to get into the, uh, into the market a little easier um, because it's not only a little bit lower in price, but the functionality of it allows them to uh, get the solution to their problem in a rapid time frame. So one of the things that we've tried to utilize is a very user friendly uh, software interface so that you don't have to be an SEM expert to actually operate this. Uh, you want to spend more time looking at the data and understanding your process as opposed to becoming an electron microscopist. So that, that also allows us to uh, have a better benefit uh, in the market as well. All right, Tim, thanks for taking the walk through the B7 Explorer. Not a problem. Thank you.